planet Earth. The perfect combination of atmosphere, soil, water, and yet we are seriously compromising not just the viability of life on this planet for ourselves, but for all of life itself. We are changing the chemistry of this atmosphere. The recent polls suggest that 76% of the people in this country know two things. Climate change is real and we have to do something about it. Equity and environmental justice and poverty has a lot to do with being vulnerable to climate change. The World Bank probably 10 years ago said climate change is in developing countries resulting in higher mortality rates. In developed countries, it's costing more money. Climate change is really a humanitarian issue, a human rights issue. We have poverty rates that are higher than any place in the country. You're talking about people that are more worried about their next meal and all of a sudden you have oil fill workers and they have a lot of money. The exploitation went crazy. If we can get climate change to cut across not just the economy, but all sectors of social justice, then all of a sudden you have people starting to support these things in different kinds of ways. Much of the anxiety that we're feeling is certainly justified, but it is not unfair to also be hopeful. And it is not incorrect to be hopeful. In fact, I think you are damaging me and you and the planet and our future if you do not remain hopeful. In the spirit of our Jesuit tradition, may this conference enable all of us to connect, to put our hearts and minds to work, and to move toward deeper insight and innovation on behalf of our planet and especially its people. What drives change is what is relevant to human beings. We are not going back to basics. We are going back to public health. We are going back to our values. We're going back to our moral standards that we have held dear and that has made this country great. We are going to invest in science. We're going to recognize it. We're going to follow the facts. We're going to do what the law says because that's what we do in the United States of America. That's what's made us great already and will keep us great. That is it.